Because of the way boys and men are typically socialized in our society, it can be very difficult for men to identify and experience their emotions. From the time boys were toddlers, most are actively discouraged from showing weakness and crying. So it's a challenge for many men to recognize their feelings of sadness or fear. And the socializing can also make it difficult for men to identify depression or anxiety. If these readily treatable disorders are unrecognized, they can go on and become more challenging problems with substance abuse or coercive intimate relationships, road rage, or even thoughts of suicide. Generally, men may transform their emotional experiences into more socially acceptable masculine experiences of intense competition. So men don't get a lot of support or experience with feeling vulnerable or the feeling of uh, being supported by other people. Specifically, athletes have been identified as having difficulty turning off those hyper-competitive feelings that are necessary for being successful in sports. In the extreme, this could lead to aggressive or maybe even abusive intimate relationships. The need for men to always be strong may leave them less equipped for those roles as being a husband or a father. Some men may have a harder time asking for help and be skeptical about the value of mental health treatment.